Y'all, I've been sitting here in the parking lot editing videos. Getting ready to go into Goodwill. And I just sit here with my door open. Uh, so I'm gonna go into Goodwill right now and see what they got. Uh, I think it's going on 6 p.m. Uh, I think it's going on 6 p.m. Half the day or the day is pretty much gone. But I did a lot of editing today, trying to catch up on my editing, trying to uh, stay in the loop with the editing and still get the other stuff that I need to get done, done. So uh, I'm just gonna go into Goodwill and look around that'll end up being a video look around and see see what i can see see what i can some little short outfits so I don't know if anybody got some little short outfits with some short sleeves they want to send me size medium I'm trying to find where is how much power we got left on this thing okay so and I don't have my mask right here. I thought about doing this years ago, y'all. Years ago, I thought about putting a little clothing store on wheels. This is so cute. This is so cute, y'all. Just looking, how you doing? You no, I'm good. I'm, I'm getting ready to go into one of these stores. I thought about doing this years ago. Yes, and uh, I just was saying, I thought about doing this years ago. I'm a vlogger. I live in my van. Yes, and so I just seen you. This, uh, this is a great idea. So you go everywhere? Blogger, so if you want to say hi to my people and let them know, you're gonna end up being on YouTube. <laughs> yeah, okay. Well, hi everyone, everybody. I'm Regina, owner of Boutique 1002. We're on Instagram, Boutique 10.02, and Facebook, Boutique 1002. We would love, huh? Oh, I don't mind. <laughs> but, um, you're welcome to come in and check it out. I'll come, come in and you want to open the door, and I'm gonna just look around and let them see. I believe in supporting black businesses. So yeah, this is her little on wheel. Is everything is everything new or used or everything's uh, new? Okay. Yes, ma'am. So she has some nice stuff, y'all. I thought about doing this years ago with vintage yes. stuff and. Did you uh, rebuild? Did you build it out yourself? We had uh, contractors build it out for us. Okay. This is one of our own people in business for herself with her husband, yes, trying to make things. I love that hat right there. Trying to make things happen. How much is the yellow hat? The yellow hat is thirty dollars. Okay. Do you have any of the colors besides that one? I like the yellow and the red one. I think we just have yellow and red left. Okay, I like that yellow, y'all. It go with the van. Ooh. Ooh, I'm sorry. 
I don't have my head. Head is actually a little sweaty. Y'all, this is cute. That would go with the band and the colors. I think I'm gonna get this, you guys, just to support one of our people. Y'all know I'm about to send me thirty dollars, okay? <laughs> Y'all, this is so neat. I'm just so happy and excited to see somebody follow their dreams, you guys. Y'all, I keep telling y'all, if y'all want, if y'all could dream it, you can make it come to, you can make it come and make it happen. And she says she's on Instagram, y'all. And she do pop-up shops and stuff like that. So y'all go check her out. I'm gonna end this uh, live right now. She's just in the parking lot here. Uh, so she could just park during the week anywhere she want. If y'all ever thought about doing something like this, this is a prime example of it being done in your city and your state. So I'm gonna I'm talk hey to y'all later. I just wanna encourage you guys, if you ever wanted to do anything like this, it could be new clothes or used clothes or vintage clothes or something else other than clothes. I thought about doing this years ago. I mean, over 20 something years ago, I didn't follow my dreams in reference to this particular thing because, you know, so many people talk you out of your dreams and you think you can't do it, but you really, really, really can. So I just want to encourage you uh, if you are in the Houston area and you know this lady, or if you're in the Houston area, uh, look her up on Instagram. Let's support black businesses. Let's support businesses in general, uh, small businesses. Let's uh, give them our money and help them stay afloat during this time. This is very nicely executed. This is an example of something that you can do uh, for yourself to provide for yourself and be independent. So, okay, y'all, I'm going into Goodwill. I just decided to bless them. Um, I know what it's like to uh, be struggling and you don't know how much money those people are gonna make today, so. I just decided to bless them and a yellow hat match my decor. I know I probably could have found something uh, else that was, I like the big brim hats, but I just wanted to support. So that was like a donation. Uh, God bless us all to be a blessing. So, you know, that and more will come back to me. I know it and I believe it in the name of Jesus. So let's go in here. I'm gonna have to mute that music right there. They close at 8 p.m. and 7 p.m. on Sundays. This looks like a pretty big store. I don't know if they're gonna have any sets, like short sets. Um, short sets or uh, pajama sets, anything like that. But I'm just looking, y'all, I'm just looking. I'm probably not gonna end up buying anything unless I just find something that screams van life these are some nice little containers not my color but if y'all looking for some little containers and stuff like that
might see something that's unique that I want, but right now, I don't see anything. But we're just looking, y'all, we're just looking.
I really was unimpressed. It don't look like they got nothing up in there. I was really unimpressed with that good Goodwill. Usually, I could find something in Goodwill that catches my eye, makes me stop. But I was unimpressed. Don't look like they want to stop. like they want to stop they don't believe in letting pedestrians go so anyway you guys that I'm hungry but I don't know what I need to eat I need to go buy something that's gonna last me a couple of days or eat something that's in the van uh, I haven't had anything to eat today besides the bananas and the uh, nuts. And that's it. They got them a generator. They had a van. They uh, things set up really nice. But anyway, y'all, that's probably not going to be it for the live, but let's ride. Let's see what I'm going to do. Let's see what I'm going to eat. Okay, y'all, I'm parked in my normal parking spot where I work on the van at. I'm about to check some measurements on top of the van to see because I want to put these other two solar panels for a total of four on top of the van this week. See if we could fit them up there or if we're gonna have to eventually turn them sideways or what I need to get my chair out of here cuz I don't have no ladder uh -oh, I think something's gonna fall I think something is going to fall
Because of that roof vent, it's gonna be harder to get four up here. Let me see something. thing look like it's closing on its own in the wind it's not open i be thinking my vent is open it's not open hold on Closed it and thought I had opened it. I don't know. But it wasn't open just now. That's that's opened right there. It wasn't open. I thought it was opened. So yeah, I'm trying to see how I'm going to be able to get four of these on top. I think 
I might have to take my roof rack down and turn them sideways and mm, let me see something I need to get the calculator out <laughs> 